Creswick is a historic gold mining town located 18 kilometres north of Ballarat and 122 kilometres northwest of Melbourne. The picturesque town is cradled between ancient volcanic hilltops and surrounded by thick pine and eucalyptus plantations, many of which were first established when the Victorian School of Forestry opened in 1910. Established during the Victorian gold rushes in the 1850s, the town was named after the Creswick Creek Pastoral Run, owned by three brothers, Henry Charles and John Creswick. In 1852, gold was discovered on Creswick Creek, and in December of that year, Walter Brackenbury, a goldfields commissioner, was appointed and his commissioner's camp became the site of the Botanic Gardens. It's estimated that there were upwards of 25,000 miners in the Creswick area at peak mining times. Alluvial gold was found easily, with deep lead mining becoming the main form of mining after the early 1870s. Notable mines in the area were the Madame Berry Mine and the New Australasian Mine. In 1882, the New Australasian Gold Mine was the scene of a major disaster when 22 miners drowned in a flooded shaft. It was a record loss of life for an Australian mine. Creswick wasn't just a mining town, it was also the Australian birthplace of reforestation. In 1882, John Le Gersh began replanting forest areas that had been ravaged by mining activity. The original Victorian School of Forestry was established in 1910 by the Department of Forestry. It was the first institution set up in Victoria to train and accredit young foresters. The forestry school influenced the laying out and planting of parks and the street trees, which gives Creswick a beautiful landscape quality. Today, Creswick is a popular tourist destination and is also known as the birthplace of both Prime Minister John Curtin and artist Norman Lindsay. There are many walking trails throughout Creswick, showcasing the rich goldfields and art history of the town. You'll also come across an array of cafes and restaurants showcasing the local produce of the region. Creswick offers a number of natural attractions and a large range of outdoor activities. Enjoy bushwalking and scenic drives through the Creswick Regional Park or visit Callum Bean Park, which was the town's Chinese camp in the gold mining days. You could also enjoy a round of golf at an international class golf course designed by Robert Allenby and Tony Cashmore at the RACV Goldfields Resort. It's certainly worth packing a detector when visiting the Creswick region. There are many goldfield areas available for gold prospectors to detect. Doug Stone's Creswick Ballarat Goldfield map provides a great resource for researching areas to detect within the region. If staying in the area, there is a huge range of accommodation options suitable for everyone, including resorts, caravan parks, B&Bs, motels and hotels. To learn more about this picturesque, historic former gold mining town, visit the Creswick Visitor Information Centre.